Well, that whole setup got destroyed. But what's up, YouTube? I'm about to go on a toy hunt with my girl right now. I'll probably grab something to eat. I'm bringing a special guest with me. Some of you might know him. He's done work on shows like Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. His name is Yamcha. I don't know, maybe he's still asleep or something. I have no idea what's wrong with him. But hopefully he brings me good luck. Spider-Man Homecoming Wave, here we come. Here we are at the very bane of my existence. <laughs> Toys of Us. Anything cool? I don't know. Here we are in the pop section. I don't see anything. We'll have to dig through it. When you come to Toys of Us, Oh, look at Captain Underpants. When you come to Toys R Us, always start in the pop section. Don't run to the Marvel Legends first. Start with the pops. Because a lot of times when they have chases, they're just right out here in the front. At least that's what I do. Where do y'all start when y'all go to Toys R Us? Let me know in the comments below. I remember reading this all the time when I was a kid. Me too. He's I'm really cute. Yeah, I kind of want to. But I have bigger and better things in my mind. <clears throat> Is there going to be any Chase Dr. Seuss's? Of course not. I'm ready to see Despicable Me 3. We'll probably go see this in the theaters. Yes. Here we are in the Marvel Legends. Holy shit. They got the Red Guardian. Nobody gives a flying fuck. I'm tired of seeing these same Marvel Legends everywhere. There's nothing. Look. This. Doctor Strange, Doctor Strange, Civil War, yeah, 1498 is not much of a clearance price. I got most of these figures for like five dollars at Walmart one time. The Star Wars department, they don't even have a single 40th anniversary figure here at all. Which, man. Look at this big headed Ray. Ew, she's ugly. Who would ever want this? Oh, but look, I see something I want. Yes. Ooh. I will take this. I wonder how much do they want for this? It's not gonna be five dollars. That's not we're gonna make them honor this price. Yeah, I think we should. <clears throat> we'll make them honor it. Should I just go ahead and I'm gonna just grab one because I want the vulture and Spider Man. How much would they really be? Probably like 10 bucks, but as you can see, all of them um, right yeah. here on the refract for five bucks. So we're going to make them honor that price. Spider-Man Pops. Look at this set. <laughs> like P2 Vision says, for things like this, you play the long game one. The long game is basically you wait and you wait and you wait because no one's gonna buy this shit. Then you get it on clearance for like 10 bucks. I played the long game on the Ninja Turtles layer. Also played the long game on the Batcave. Didn't even wind up buying the Batcave, but I did get the Ninja Turtles layer. layer. You know, I'm not like too excited, like I really, really want this, but I like to use it for the backdrop of my toy photography. You know, cause if you get someone to do you a custom value, you're gonna pay a couple hundred dollars. Or you could just buy this on clearance for 13 bucks. You decide. There's my girl digging through the Tsum Tsum. She's an avid Tsum Tsum collector. They only have one left. They got the new series? They got series six, but. Where is it? There's only one. I'll get it. 
Do you even know where the fuck it is? I forgot where I put it. Shit! Yeah. yeah. You'll never find that thing again. Hey, the Are last one. Yes, it's the last one. Who can you get on there? I want Piglet. Yeah, our dog's name is Piglet, so. And my nickname is Look, Pooh. Bell and Beast have a. They have like a whole little backdrop where they dance at, like a dance ball. That's pretty cool. And here's some loose zoom zooms for free. <laughs> oh, I think I cheated. I know what it is. What is it? I think it's Randall from Bugs. I think that's what it is. I can feel that's it. That's a little baby ant. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. They got the new mini Wolverine mini mates out. This one has Mojo and Spiral. Oh, I'm getting this. Look at that <laughs> shit. It's Toys R Us exclusive. Ooh. Tactical Wolverine, Marvel Now, Magneto. And also, I think you can get Weapon X and Lady Deathstrike. That's really dope. But I think I'm going to get a, the TRU exclusive. Yeah. So far, I'm getting this. I'm getting this. My old lady's going to get this soon soon. We actually buy stuff on our toy hunts. <laughs> Let's see what else we can find. More stuff than we need. Always look at this. Um, it's like forty bucks. I really, really want it, but I'm gonna wait. You should. I can feel feel a tear forming up right here. This shit is so fucking dope. Yes. But I'm gonna wait. Here. I don't collect predator toys really. Look at this jungle hunter predator. Like that's really detailed and it's a glare on it. I Sorry guys. Just, should I start collecting predators? No. <laughs> we should not. Alright. Alright, so we're out of Toys R Us. As I said I picked up the Toys R Us exclusive mini mate set. If y'all are sleeping on mini mates, I don't know how many times I gotta tell y'all, stop sleeping on mini mates. They're amazing. This was $7.49, I think. Got my girlfriend, the Tsum Tsum. I gotta say that, honestly, I like Tsum Tsum too, but I kind of use her as an excuse because they're kind of girly. How many Tsum do you think we got now? Like 150? Yeah, a lot. And I got this. And yes, no questions asked. They honored the $4.99, you know, price point. Whenever you go to a store and you see something on the wrong rack, wrongly priced, never be afraid to ask about it. Never be afraid to tell them because stores are supposed to honor that price. And lately, like I used to just, you know, not do it, be afraid to do it, be shy. Lately, I've been doing it and I do it like every time I go somewhere. Walmart always messes up. Toys R Us always messes up. I do it all the time. Save a lot of money that way. So that's all for Toys R Us pickups. I don't know where we're else we're going to go today. Who fucking knows? We don't ever make plans. We just go with the flow. So check back in when we get to the next destination. Bye. All right. So my fig hunt has been rudely interrupted by my girlfriend. Who wants to fucking eat checkers? <laughs> Checkers is totally disgusting. I know maybe in your area you have a Rallies, but we have Checkers and it's just fucking greasy and gross. It's delicious. It's not delicious at all. It's disgusting. Chick-fil-A is far superior. But yeah, I'll be back shortly to hopefully look for some toys. Instead of eating this garbage. Mm. So this is the, what is this? A peppercorn steak burger. Peppercorn steak burger. Can you see how disgusting that looks? It looks amazing. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below what you think about this. It's good, isn't it? It's tasty, babe. Yes, it is. It's not that good. He's a hater. Sure, he's a hater. 
All right, pulling up the targets. Fingers crossed, everyone. Fingers crossed. Target now has this retro toy section, and look what the fuck they got. Stretch Armstrong. I haven't seen one of these since I was a wee lad. You don't know shit about Stretch Armstrong. You know about Light Bright? Yeah. And etch a sketch. Girl, you don't know nothing about no Light Bright? Etch a sketch is okay. Look at this crazy chicken. We already have like 20 of those. I'm not serious. So we need more. Okay. Apparently we need more Sim Sims. Harley Quinn is on sale for $10. No thank you. Wonder Woman. I don't think I've ever seen a store stock as many exclusives as this Target stock Rowdy Roddy Piper. Like they had at least like, at least a hundred, like not even exaggerating. There's not gonna be nothing in this section. Oh Wonder God. if you just find a Qui-Gon Jinn. Mm -hmm. Here we are in the Legends Department. At least they have a Colossus. Still no Spider-Man Homecoming Wave. No, I don't need him. I need Wave 2. I have all of those. Come on, Spider-Man Homecoming. You got all your other toys out. Why hasn't your other toys hit this fucking place yet? Jesus Christ. I know Cars has never been my favorite movie franchise. But look. His paint job is super dope. I know my camera's not gonna pick it up right. This is super dope, shiny paint job. You want him? Yes. He's red chrome. Does his box look okay? It's fine. So we got the Lightning McQueen. He's coming home with us. Now to find more stuff. In the Star Wars section. There's no other 40th anniversary figures besides the one my girlfriend just showed me. Look at this. Rest in peace. And look, it's also a fig swap. You can see the box. Imperial AT ACT driver. But we just have this Cassian. Like, damn. People just give no fucks at all. <laughs> Has anyone picked up this Target exclusive yet? I'm not paying 30 bucks for it, but it's definitely pretty cool. Now in every Target I go, and every video I see, like the pop section has become desolate and just filled with like clearance pops. Does this mean the end? Does this mean the end? to the pop section at Target. I thought it was a good idea, but obviously it didn't sell good. Probably because Target employees are assholes and steal all the good pops and keep them in the back. Are you sad? Mm -hmm. See, DVDs like this just bring back a lot of memory. I used to have things like this. I used to have things like this on VHS. And for everybody out there with a 4K player, like, how much better is it than Blu-ray? I've been thinking about getting a 4K player, but I still haven't gotten any around to it yet. Look at this. Oh, shit. They're all steelbooks. We have Lone Survivor, Scarface, To Kill a Mockingbird, The Sting, 8 Mile, Unbroken. Straight out of Compton and London has fallen. Other than toys, I am a sucker for movies, a sucker for Blu rays, and definitely a sucker for still books. So, Scarface is coming home with me. For sure, for sure. Everything else maybe can stay, but Scarface, definitely gonna have to take that. Grabbed a few things out of Target.
market, but I'm going to show y'all that on like one of my pickup videos. Right now, I'm about to walk into Barnes and Nobles. I don't know if I really film much in there. So they usually don't have nothing, but we'll see what's up. This is really dope. Not today, but mark my words. I'm gonna get that. Here's some cool boys from Yaki model kits. Anything cool over there? I just order stuff. I definitely say think he's got the best pop collect like selection in Savannah. Look, hey. Find Chucky. Yeah, and Chucky it. and Tommy. No chase, I'm sure, but I know at least one Chucky. Now we're in GameStop. So it's like GameStop had a disaster over here. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow, they still got this? That's crazy. Alright, so that's going to bring it into this little video today. We had fun hunting. I picked up, you know, a few things, which I'm going to show you on my recent, pick, recent pickups video. It'll be out in the next couple of days after I accumulate a few more things. Me and my girlfriend about to chill, hang out, watch Scarface. Y'all have a nice day. Be sure to hit the like button. And if you don't know, that's the thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at FunkyPop underscore 912. And you have a good day, YouTube.